Hello, it's me, Matt, and not Miss Ati. See you in the video. Oh, hey guys, what's, whoa, whoa, oh, oh no, whoa, oh, Whew. sorry, what's up guys, how you doing? It's me, Matt, I'm back for another one, because you guys are great and I missed you. I'm actually gonna teach you how to do that whole falling sequence, which actually wasn't falling, it was planned, and those are moves I'm gonna show you. Let's go. Okay, number one. First thing you saw me do, a knee drop. So this is a way to get to the floor, right? So what you're gonna do is you're going to take one foot, I'm gonna do my left foot, it's gonna come behind you and it's gonna hook right underneath behind your knee this way, right? And so what you're gonna do is you're going to bend your knee and you're gonna fall, quote unquote, and onto this toe. So I'm not actually landing on the side of my knee, I'm going, boink. So if you see, I'm landing on my toe first and then that's cushioning my fall. So I'm not actually, smacking the side of your knee into the ground. So it hurts, I've done it before. Don't do that. So, once you're down on the floor, you wanna use these big leg muscles you got to help spring you back up. So imagine that this is like a little springboard moment where you're going, boom, got, whoa, back up. That's one version. The version you saw me do, keeping you on the floor, boom, bah, and you're there. Whoa, but not fall and you're there, and you're ready to do anything else you wanna do back on the floor. Great. Okay, so, number two. We're doing a knee spin. So, if you have carpet or a soft surface, I recommend you use that when you're first trying it because your poor knees or knee pads, highly recommended. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna start down. One knee on the floor, one knee is up. So you're in this nice kind of sit-up position. And then what you're gonna do is you're going to Shift your knees. So I'm gonna put my right knee down and I'm gonna replace it and bring my left knee up. So this is coming down. You notice I'm twisting my body too. So now I'm facing this way. And then I'm gonna keep going. Uh, yeah. And then bring up that left. So it looks weird and kind of like choppy if you don't have momentum, which is what you need to get around. So to get your momentum, that's where your arms are gonna come in. So I have my right arm across here. I'm gonna throw this arm across. And that is gonna give me the spin to get around. So you're going, whoo, whoo, whoo. Yeah, kind of quick. Let me break that down one more time for y'all. So I'm starting with my right knee down, my left knee up, but you can go either way. You can actually even go back and forth if you want to. Maybe I'll try that. But slowly again, you're here. My right knee's gonna come down. I'm spinning on that left. Both knees are down. I'm gonna keep turning over that shoulder. As I keep turning, I'm picking up that left knee. And when you have momentum, this is gonna carry you all the way around. <sighs> Tend to back where you were. Quick version again. <sighs> You're here, using my arm this time. So I'm gonna throw my arm across, same thing as before, that knee comes down, <clears throat> and I'm back up. Give it a shot, it's fun. When you get it, it's a good time. Okay, number three, coffee grinder. Classic breakdance move. So for this one, you are gonna be kind of shifting your weight forward and back onto your wrist. So take a minute, maybe get some wrist stretches in there. Make sure you're nice and warm. I also recommend you do a couple of these guys where you're on your, your toes and you just lean forward onto your hands. Pick your back feet off the ground. A Couple of those. So you get used to that rocking motion. That's kind of what you're gonna be doing in this move. So when you're here, after you're nice and warm, you're going to be on your toes. So you're this way. One foot, I'm gonna use my right side, is gonna be after the side here. So you're balancing this way. My hands are gonna be in front. I'm going to swing this out leg out and around this way. So slow-mo first, it's gonna go front, and then it's gonna keep going this way. And as you go this way, I'm gonna let my weight fall to my right hand to get it around. And this is the part where you're gonna rock forward, because you wanna rock forward onto your hands to pick this left knee up to swing the other one around. Boom. Yeah, and again, this is one of those moves that's hard to do slowly, because you need momentum to help you. So a quick motion of that, you're going out and around, yeah? Let me break that down one more time. So, you're starting off, you're on your toes. Yeah, send one leg out to the side, I'm doing my right side. From here, it's gonna swing out and around, 
As far as it'll go this way, I'm shifting my weight away from my leg so I can get this foot off the floor. Around, whoop, up and over. Yeah. Oh. Let's work on your knees, boy. I'm not, I'm not young anymore. Okay, full speed version real quick here. Yeah. So, leg is out, boom. You wanna really send this around. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There we go. Give it a try. Okay, let me show you that from the back really quick. Break that down. So from here, the knee drop. Left foot is gonna come behind your right knee. Boom, landing on your toe, not your knee. From there, you're gonna spring back up, around. That right foot is gonna step out to the side, come down. So you're prepping for that knee spin here. Yeah, you're turning around. Boom. From there, my hands come down the floor. I sit back onto my left toe. Right heel comes out, around, boom. and out. Cool, all right, give that a try. Make sure you got padding for your, your poor knees, carpet, knee pads, any of those still work fine. Be good, have fun, see you later. We out. Matt, do the outro. Oh, Jesus Christmas, hi, we're doing it? All right, out, uh, outro, great. I've been Matt. Those were three moves you can do in sequence. I haven't done that part yet because Brayden wanted to launch into the outro, but you know what? We're going to do it right now. Maybe it's before the outro. Maybe it's after the outro. I don't know. Brayden decides. Brayden's running the show now, guys. Huh? I'm going to take five real quick. Brayden.